Have you, you been killed? No, I made it in one piece somehow. What now? Your environment suit is within umbilical range of my rig. You should be seeing extra tactical readouts. Minimap, radar, loadout details, as long as you stay close to the rig. You may conform. Good deal. Use your radar to see advancing enemies. Look now! Hey, Sammy. Pick up the glowing orange blood the animals leave behind. You will need it for later. That's fast. Thanks, boss. I know what I'm doing here. Do it yourself. Huh. Okay, you're all set. Yes, sir. You got incoming. friend on this base. We all miss Diaz. But I tried to warn you, Nevik would never use that an excuse until they started seeing results. It's not about you, You know it's not. Oh, so you're still blaming me, though? I never said that. You didn't have to. You just checked out. They're looking for something that doesn't exist. I'm directing my efforts where the science leads. That used to matter to you. It still does, Bonnie, but this isn't my call. Nevik is footing the bill for this operation. They insisted. And that's it. Not a peep from you. Not a... <laughs> it's only because of me that you still even have a job here. Oh, yes, a job answering to... Him. Uh, Dr. Kovach, I see you made it in one piece. Yes, it's been an eventful morning. Phil Braddock, I presume? Mm -hmm. Dr. Roman? Been some time. Feels like yesterday, Kenny. You'll excuse me. Okay. And you must be Jim Payton. You really stepped up out there, huh? You must have a million questions. I uh, hope you don't mind being thrown in at the deep end. Uh, sir, I'm here to work. All I need to know is how a man can earn some credits around here. <laughs> Thermal energy. That's the name of the game. Acred blood? I used to tell you, boss, we just spilled gallons of the stuff. Oh, it's well more than that. Flows through everything on EDN3. 
creatures, tectonics, all the way down to the core. That's what makes life possible in a climate like this. No other substance like it in the universe. And Nevek believes this can solve the energy crisis on Earth. Well, I believe it can. We're here to study it. Find a way to make it viable, cost-effective for harvest and export. We are leaving no angle unexplored. Very good. Science is always best, without boundaries. Pete and I got a lot of contracts that'll keep you busy. Construction repairs on the base, but uh, if you want to go home a rich man, you'll take on that hazard pay. Keep us supplied with this stuff. Yes, sir. Just point me to my rig. Peyton, I can't recommend strongly enough that you visit the Quartermaster and get yourself a good hunting knife. You've seen how up close and personal the acrid can get. But first you want to head down to the service pit and inquire with our lead tech, Gail, as to the status of your rig. Welcome aboard, Jim. Uh, Doctor, if you'll stay and chat, 